Hi everybody! Ganabeard Grows here. How you doing? How you doing? I got another box. Holy crap, man. I am friggin' blessed. Well, this is uh, a brand new light, actually. Uh, I don't know. Hold on here. I got this thing. Um, first off, let me say that this light was given to me free by Viper Spectra. So my opinions, while are slightly swayed to free products know that i honestly do like this product and i would not accept more product from a company that i didn't like or didn't use i still use my uh uh my 1500 and uh so now we're gonna check this brand new version out they wanted to uh they liked what i have done showing off the previous one so they wanted me to show off this one as well so how could I say no? They've been so good to the beard. And uh, well, like I said, the their, their light kind of speaks for itself. Spoke for itself. Speak, spoke, whatever. <clears throat> so here we go. This is the brand new, um, yeah, there we go. Uh, this is the, the, the 1000 model. There we go, look at that, that is. Pretty nice. The XS 1000. Now comes the now comes in a 1000 model. This is actually pretty new. Um, so last time um, I did a review on these, um, they only had uh, this one, this one, and this one. Uh, this is the one I have currently outside, and this is this is the new the new little baby brother that they've just added to the series. So it goes a thousand, fifteen, two thousand, four thousand. Oof, there goes my knees going clack. This is a, a, I'll tell you right now, feeling this is a nice piece of hardware. It's got a good, nice silicone coating on this. It feels really sturdy, it feels good. Um, this, the back piece of hardware is very nicely mounted. It's got a good amount of space in between uh, 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 the actual Meanwell driver and uh, uh, all of the heat sinking in here. And it's got this nice little, uh, dimmable switch that feels like a nice guitar pedal. Crank it to 11. Nice. It's good. Um, and I actually really like this feature right here. Um, this is a very standard plug adapter. Um, so you can kind of plug any of those standard plugs into that. So what, what do we got here in the, what's in the little box, man? So we got some, some hanging software. We got the plug. We got, oh, what's this down in here? Um, oh, more hanging software, nice. Okay, so we got two hanging ratchet sets, and then we got two um, wire cambiner uh, 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 and clip combos for the, for the actual system. And then this to hang it up into your tent. That's nice, I always like it when, uh, when they give you those things. I feel a little bit, I honestly feel a little bit Almost, I don't want to say ripped off, but I feel let down when I get a light and it doesn't have ratchet sets, you know, or proper hanging devices. You're like, come on, why don't you have it? Anyway, uh, Viper Spectra knows what they're doing and they do have all of that for sure. Um, now, one thing I do want to mention is that this is very, very, very similar to a light um, that I've reviewed in the past. Um, the, the Spider Farmer 1000. Um, I used the Spider Farmer 1000 in one of my three by three tents for uh, my Cannabeard Cup Grow, actually, um, in a head-to-head -head versus um, uh, a Vivo Sunlight. Now, I'm a little bit curious. I'm gonna pit this in the tent, in that very same tent, um, up against the Spider Farmer of the equivalent value and just, uh, to see what happens, see what the difference really is. See if there's a, a, a um, like a, a, a lux or a par, par difference or whatever. I've got a little, oh, I don't have the meter on me. I've got a meter in the other room. Let's go step into the other room here and have a look, shall we? Let's go do that. Okay, here we go. Let's have a look inside the three by three, what I have happening in here. I built this really, really rickety, uh, uh, every uh, stand for these plants. Um, they split, the wood was terrible. I just used garbage cheap wood and I paid for it. As you can see, the splits everywhere. 
Anyway, anyway, we're not here to look at that. Uh, here we go. This is a Spider Farmer 1000 right there. Sitting at full capacity. Um, now let's, uh, uh, let's sit down the, um, I've got this meter here, this guy right here. Um, the doctor meter. Now I know this isn't perfect, but it gives you a good baseline that you can check and compare against your other tents and systems and stuff. It's not exactly a perfect readout. Like I said, it's more about just trying to dial in what you do have compared to your other things. So, uh, give me a second and, uh, uh, We'll, we'll, we'll see what this thing looks like. Okay, so let's turn it on, change the decimal point to a, a readable, <clears throat> a readable uh, number here. Let's go with this one here, there we go. So at this point right here, pretty much sitting, that's pretty dead center under the light. It's about 150. Off to the sides here, we're looking at about yeah, 140. What's the middle of this tray look like? 120. So it drops a little bit on the sides. About 130 on, on that far one there. So that's not too bad. So that's the spider farmer sitting between 150 and about 120 for the center of all of these trays. So let's swap out that light and see what happens. Okay, there we go. Uh, let's crank that up to, oh, yeah, right there we go. Crank it up to, to max. Um, I used the same hanging hardware and measured it. Uh, so it's, it's uh, same hanging height as the, as the previous light. Let's mount this, uh, mount this on the tripod here. And we're gonna do the exact same test again. We're gonna bust this thing out. We're gonna bring the decimal points down to a readable a readable level and we're going to stick it right in the dead center there and <laughs> look at that that is uh no no fucking lying no joke i bite my tongue a little bit i've been uh ranting and raving about spider farmers for quite a while and that's no fucking lie that is a noticeable jump we got more on the side trays than we had in the center from the spider farmer. No slag on spider farmer, but gosh darn. Wow. <clears throat> yeah, I don't mean to burn no bridges with the spider farmer company. They've been good to me, but uh, that tells you the tale right there, man. This, uh, the new Viper Spectras, these pro series, man. These are pretty nice fricking systems. They really are. I've got, uh, I've got links below to this brand new light and some discount codes down there. So if you guys want to save some money on this one or any of the new ProLine series, you can check them out below in the links below there. Um, get yourself a little discount. Save some money on one of these kick-ass new lights. Um, I mean, what else? What do you want me to say? That says it all right there. Anyway, thank you very much, Viper Spectra, for uh, sending me another one of your lights to check out and test and use. And uh, I will most definitely be keeping this light in here for my seedling, uh, for my spring project. So right on. Thank you. Cheers. Have a good day.